Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dank Deck, and today we're starting a brand new series. We are going to be play playing a game called Bramble the Mountain King. So, I was at work today, and I got a surprise email from Steam saying that I'd been given a gift by Sir Oak. So, um, thank you very much, Sir Oak. It's greatly appreciated. I went and watched the trailer quickly. It looks somewhat like um, Little Nightmare, is it? The game I watched once upon a time. Um, there is a warning that I read at the start about um, topics that may upset people, suicide and stuff like that. So, here is the warning for the entire series, because I'm not going to do one at the start of every single episode. There are topics that may upset people, so if um, you don't want to watch that sort of thing, then fair enough, don't watch this series. It's fine if you don't want to watch it. Um... I've got no idea what this game is about. Like I say, the only thing I've watched is the trailer. And it just reminded me of Little Nightmares. So, um, again, thank you very much, Sir Oak. And if you enjoy the series, you guys have got to thank Sir Oak as well. He's been around on my Discord, in my community for God knows how long. He's one of my admins now. We eventually uh, we eventually got him up there. Um, so, yeah. I'll, I'll say thank you to Sir Oak. Thank you, Sir Oak. Um, like I do normally at the start of these series, if you'd like to take a look in the description below of any video that is, um, I've got three links for myself. There's one for Twitch, one for Discord, one for Patreon. My link to Twitch is so you can come watch me stream. Currently, me and my brother are playing Seven Days to Die. We're using Twitch integration so you guys can come in and try and kill us or help us, whichever takes you fancy. We've already been killed once. Well, my brother's been killed a couple of times, but the stream has, uh, the stream has killed me once. Um, the link to Discord, so you can come be part of the community, you know, post in the channels, anime, pets, what food you're eating, music, stuff like that. Also, come join in with some games when we're playing them. Um, we do tend to play, like, Seven Days to Die on occasion. Uh, we've been playing a little bit Strange Brigade, or a lot of us have got Strange Brigade. We've not managed to get together to all play it yet, but, yeah, you can come do that. And if you'd like to support the channel, it's um, greatly appreciated through Patreon. Um, it gets you a rank on Discord and all that sort of jazz. You can watch me stream these episodes live onto Discord. I'm not doing this one on Discord because in all fairness, um, I'm very, very tired. So looking across to keep reading things isn't advisable. Um, but yeah, greatly appreciated anybody that decides to support the channel. It also gets your name on the, uh, the credits at the end of every one of my videos. Plus it gives you the chance for naming a game perks. I would like to do it so that them people that do support the channel can view these videos as soon as I upload them. I'm pretty sure that only works if you're a member of my YouTube community, which I've got set up. Um, it's just the, the, the people that are supporting the channel at the minute do it through Patreon. So um, I might start doing that and see if there's a way that I can get it to the people that support on Patreon. I'm not sure. I'll have to do some searching. But that is something I'd like to do so you guys that do support can get to see the videos the second they're uploaded sort of thing. Below my three links are six more. There are two for Night Raven, two for Cal Phallus, and two for Teacot. All three of them are my admins. Again, they've all been around as long or longer than Sir Oak. Um, they all play uh, games like Phasmophobia, Demonologist, um, Raven and Cal Phallus did like uh, some of the, what is it, the Dark Anthologies? I probably got that wrong. Games like The Quarry and stuff like that, they played together. Teacot does um, videos about wrestling and stuff like that. Um, we all stream together quite often. So, um, yeah, go show them guys some love as well. I won't mention any of my links again throughout the uh, the series, but... I think we should dive into this. I'm interested. Hopefully I've got the sound about right, and hopefully my microphone decides not to be a douche and cut out at any point. But again, final time I mention it, there are sensitive topics in this game, and so um, view at your own risk. Anyway, new game. Subtitles are turned on, so you should be able to read along. I'm nervous about this. I don't know what I'm getting myself into. A nightmare woke him up. Frightened by his mother's bedtime story. The very pretty looking game, I'll say that straight away. He searched for his sister's comfort. But she was nowhere to be found.
that is proper gorgeous. Really is cracking graphics. I'm not about graphics when it comes to games. I'm, I'm happy for good gameplay, but I'll take good graphics when I've got them. So from what I read of the blurb on um, Steam, it's about us trying to find our sister. Box of matches. Oh my god, look how it falls around. Oh! Bar to return. It doesn't look like I can get in here. There's no other prompts coming up, so... What else have we got around here? I mean, obviously there's the, um, the thing tied through the window. The controls are weird. I'm using the mouse to move the camera. Oh. Who snuck out of her bedroom window at night, oh. even though her mother had told her not to. She went into the forest, oh, and at gorgeous. first it welcomed her with warmth and a promise of adventures. I hope my face isn't going to be in the way as well. I'm leaving it up there for now. But soon, the forest seemed to grow colder and darker. The girl was afraid, and she wanted to go home. But Bramble crawled around her arms and legs, and she could not get away. And the girl was never seen again. Oh. Have we got some foreshadowing? That is what happens when you do not listen to your mother. Especially you, Lilimore. Their mother had said before kissing them goodnight. Hmm. Sister's a little bit taller than we are. Unless we tiptoe. No, she's still taller. You can't cheat like that. That's rude. I want to check all these things first before I check the door. Do you paint figurines? Ah, it fell over. We don't want that. What's this map? Or picture. It's a picture. I've got a feeling this is going to be one of them games where we've got to be um, paying attention to details. I mean, fair enough. It looks like somebody's in the middle of the forest and then there's all the forest creatures around. In fact, there isn't a, um, a thing on the window at the minute. I guess we've got to try this first. Is Mother going to tell us off? Or are we just checking to make sure the coast's clear before, yeah, before we climb through the window? One more look at them matches. Oh, we're kicking the ball around the floor. Svenska... I struggle to read English, let alone other languages. Here we go. We're leaving. And now the darkness outside scared him. I mean, I live pretty close to a forest, like literally just down the street from where I live. Go down a path and that's it. I wouldn't fancy walking around there as it was getting dark. Not being with his sister scared him even more. And definitely not when it was dark. I've been walking through through the daytime before and somebody walked out of the bushes that seemed like a little bit not all there. It wasn't a fun experience. Anyway, we're a child and we're going into the forest. Oh, look at that. I'll get over the graphics at some point, but until then. You should have at least taken your candle with you was a familiar place during the day. Keep your eye out for little white blips that we can go and investigate or talk to. Night, it was a different story. Dead atmospheric this is. There was no trace of Lilimur, and Ulle wished he could ask the pine cones if they had seen her. Be a bit weird talking to a pine cone. I mean, oh! There we do! If the pine cones knew about her fate, they kept it to themselves. I'm dead tempted to turn my light on, on the side off. 
It's a pine cone. Talk to him. Ask it if you've seen it's seen your sister. Oh. What's this? Oh, it's E. I'm left clicking. Little pine cone army thingy be jiggy. Okay. I guess we're going up hither. I don't know if this fall damage. Ooh, dear. Don't do that to me, dear. I just realised I said, oh dear. Is there something on the left there? It seems a little bit glowy. I'm just holding W. I've not got to balance on this as far as I'm aware. The game is auto-balancing for me. Sploosh. Stuck the landing, nearly. It's a very pretty looking tree. Oh, there's more pine cones. And eaten apples. Is there anything else we can assess around here? No. Okay. I just want to be having a look around and making sure. Don't want to miss anything, if I can help it. I always start off with good intentions in games like this, trying to find absolutely everything, but later down the line it'll be like, right, let's go. Is this our tree house? That's cool. If it is. Another box of matches. It is. Nothing on the bottom that we've got to pay attention to, no? A very ominous looking um, doll thing. Find the Lillimore wooden figurine. Okay. That was that was the achievement I just unlocked. Can't take the knife then. I already I already know about the rotating. There's a key. Hey. Give me that. I see why it gave me the um, the other. Matchbox to have a look at. And I guess that will open this. It's alright, it's one of them new self-closing doors. You've you've not got to be concerned at all. Didn't you see the mechanism? It's all computerized. It wasn't, I'm lying to you. Alright, we're starting to get into some platformer stuff now. Yup. 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 I'll stop doing that at some point. <clears throat> Probably not, but I'll say I will. No, look at that! Can we go this way? Are we meant to go this way? Are we not meant to go up and over here? Oh, I thought I was meant to jump up there. I was going the wrong way intentionally, but apparently I wasn't. Yeah. Nope, can't do it. That probably hurt a little bit more. This doesn't look like a place you want to be in. Oh no. Ominous music's fading in. Raise yourself, guys. Don't say that's my sister. Game completed. In the dark. A symbol of hope. Oh my god, is it Navi? More Karina of Time. The Legend of Zelda, in case you still don't get it from that. Listen. Hey. A spark of courage. Maybe this is Link's origin story. And your sister is really Zelda. Link's got brown hair, right? Or is it blonde? It's been ages since I played a Zelda game. Twilight Princess was the last one I played. I didn't enjoy it. Wind Waker? I'd happily play that again. And Ocarina of Time was the first game I ever completed as a child. Loved that game. There is things on Steam as well about the, uh, the soundtrack for this and how beautiful it is. I assume we're climbing up this, by the way. 
So I'm expecting some brilliant music as well from it. As well as the gorgeous graphics. I have no idea where we are. I hope I'm not meant to be keeping track of that. Alright, looks like we're meant to jump up there, but can we walk around to the side? No, we can't. Okay. Is that the sister? It seems like it is. Game completed it. What do you have there? Lily Moore asked. It glimmers beautifully. What a strange fog. Light as a feather. She investigated closely. Oh. The moonstone. Let us play, little brother. Lillemore babbled. See if you can knock down this pine cone. Oh god. Aim. And throw. Does it go exactly where I'm aiming? Yes. Gimme. Oh, I clicked to pick it up again. And throw. Oh, there, you can sprint. It doesn't look like he's sprinting much quicker. I'm going to throw it at you. It kind of locks on a little bit. So I was wondering if I had to, like, counter. Oh, it doesn't quite lock on as much as I thought it did. You've just got to wait for it to get to the uh, apex of the, the throw, I guess. Oh, you want it, do you? You think you can handle this? You sure? <gasps> no, my new stone! Oh! I wouldn't have dived towards the edge of a cliff like that for it. Oh boy. I am taking a shed load of screenshots because I don't want know what I want to use for the first... Words are difficult. I don't know what I want to use for the f first thumbnail. Put my teeth back in. Oh god. Together, they tumbled down deep dodge, duck, dip, dive and dodge. I'm trying to control it, but I don't actually know if it's making any difference. Zoom! Why is it daytime in here? Where have we gone? Narnia? We've shrunk, haven't we? Otherwise, there are some gigantic oh, mushrooms. I will protect you. Is this like an Alice in Wonderland sort of thing? She was never scared like him. Ulle wished he could be a little more like his sister. How did they say his name? Lili to me, that's Ollie. Loved adventures, and Ole loved Lily. Ole, Ole, Lily. I can't do it, it's Ollie. Ooh, nearly. Come back. Yeah, yeah. She's, she's not waiting for me at all, is she? Not very nice, sister. Have we been shrunk or...? Steady. Steady. Ooh, you're gonna get... Jesus Christ, I knew it was coming. Yeah, we've been shrunk. Oh my God, that apple would last you forever. <laughs> what is that? I mean, it looks like a gnome. Keep eating the apple. That'll last you forever. What's this? Oh! Man, to you, Tim. What's that meant to be like? Some sort of pixie fairy thing? 
Oh, camera's guiding me around this way, so I assume we're climbing up this thing. It's showing me exactly where I need to go at the minute. Enjoy it while it lasts, I guess. Oh. Please tell me the gnome's not just been nailed with the bell. Oh, got to hold left control to crouch. Oh, there's a there's a, a doodar in the corner. It's alright, I'm getting there. You may want to move. I mean, we're tiny, but that thing's tiny, tiny. <laughs> what the hell? Can I not jump up there on the left? Nope. Mind you had. Oh, you're all friendly now. You're running away a second ago. It is a gnome. Playful creatures. They live peacefully in daylight and keep in their houses at night. Nothing over there for us to check out. Visitors Have you got a pet hedgehog? Heard of until this day. Ah, we can pick this up as well. It's another figurine thing. Thank you. Gnome figurine. Appreciated. I mean, if it's going to keep giving me the white blip to have a look. Rude. If it's going to keep giving me the white blip to look at, then I should be able to find most of these things. <clears throat> yes, because the gnome is doing a lot of effort there. Uh, he's probably giving a lot of effort, but he's doing a lot, right? So, we're not allowed in that way. The white blip is still there. Oh, are, we, are you summoning a friend to come and help? Oh my god, there's an army of them. Hey guys. Can you open this door for me, please? Oh wait, I've missed two. I forgot to, like... I've got to be praised by them first. Oh no. Don't play hide and seek with them. Hey, that's cheating. Turn back around. <laughs> I see you. I can hear you on the left there. You that. I can see you. One there. One there. I mean, I technically already found you. It's just there was one sort of next to you. There. You've got to help me now. I found you all. We're friends, right? Do we just become best friends? Eve ho! Nice. And she's run off again. God damn it, Felicia. <laughs> Where'd you go, sister? Oh, the gnome's going to watch me everywhere. What are these? Even smaller than the gnomes. It's Papa Smurf. I forgot to go in here. It looks like you're queuing for me to go in here. As though we've got to round something up. Ah. You, go that way. Ah. Just got to herd these things in. Yeah, it gives you a clue with that first field there, doesn't it, at the top left. Go on. Don't you go to the right, you camel. No. Get them two in there first. I've just realised.
my face is genuinely in the way. You guys can't see there's um, little icons up at the top corner there to show you how many we need. Get in the pen, you. Thank you. Right, my face is living here for a little bit now. Yeah! I mean, you didn't do anything, but good job, team. And I actually missed one if you look down the right. Left. You stop running away! I'm going to assume we don't want to go in the water. The water is bad, okay. It's going to eat me. It's a frog. It's a king frog. That is one ugly looking frog. Ew. That's what you get for keep running off. It's gonna lick me now, isn't it? Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Well, guess we're not going back that way anymore. I'm fine with that. The story progresses. This camera angle is a little bit weird. And again, it doesn't look like there's any white blips around for me to click on, so we're just climbing straight up, following the path. Yeah, and jump. Get a little bit of uh, height. Nope, I, I screwed that one up, something fierce. Mm. 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 Oh, where's this lead to? Yep. Ah, it looks a little bit. Don't, don't do it. Stop sliding. Ooh, yeah, that looks a little bit faster. Water, Christ Almighty! I'm dead already. Left shift sprint. Well, at least I got the first death out of the way early on. The camera angle, right? That's what I'm blaming it on. It was a little skew if. <laughs> they were both curious in different ways. While Lilimor quickly it's a pixie, along, or a fairy, or something. Ule could get completely enthralled. I don't think you want to go to the bottom of there, my dude. That is a long way down. And suddenly, Ule was what? alone again. She ran off and left me. Like, properly ran off and left me this time. And it's dark again. All right, we're just going to follow Tinkerbell. Just keep glancing around. Yo! Still the landing. It's a good, good job the um, vine thing was on the way down there. Go, go, go. Jump, jump. If you hear something crunch like that, you're not going to take your time on it. That is craziness. Oh, hi. How'd you get up there? It's the BFG! Well, I can't keep complaining that she's running off now. Oh, Christ, it's coming for me. 
Dodge. Rude. Kidnapped my sister and tried to get me as well. God damn it. The river was strong and Ule was weak. Ule. Ule? Did not stand a chance. But soon the sound of the river faded. Ole was happy to have firm ground under his feet again. Well, I think we're going to wrap up here for our very first episode. I'm, I'm liking the start of this game. It's starting off very light and upbeat until my sister got kidnapped. And um, we're just going to have to go and find her, aren't we, in the next episode. So you'll have to come back to see that. Like I said, again, thank you very much, Sir Oak, for buying the game. Greatly appreciated. Everyone else, thanks, Sir Oak, if you're enjoying the game. And then have a look in the description below. My three links, the six links down there, two for Night Raven, two for Calthalus, and two for Teacup. And uh, yeah, if you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more. All comments and feedback greatly appreciated. As always, and other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers!